When Ronald Reagan called the USSR an evil empire in a speech in 1983, it indicated to the world that detente was over. Even though Reagan's stance towards the Soviet Union changed over the course of his administration, this was a big moment. We'll take a look at the Twilight Struggle event card that represents it here, today, on Legendary Tactics. In Twilight Struggle, an evil empire is a card that doesn't move the needle very much either way. It has some marginal utility for the US, but the USSR is likely not to sweat this one too much. Let's take a close look at it here now. First of all, the event. An Evil Empire is a starred US Late War 3-op event card. If the event is triggered, it cancels or prevents the Flower Power event, and the US gains one victory point. For the Soviet player, this is a card that you will take for the operations points, unless you are on the brink of losing the game by automatic victory. You may also want to get rid of this event to the space race when you stand a good chance of winning via the War Games event next turn if it happens to come to hand, but the score is close. This is a gamble though. And of course, you will space it if you could lose to auto victory. If the Flower Power event is in force, you may want to make this one of the last cards you play in a turn, just in case the US has to play some war cards this turn and you want to snag those victory points before the event is cancelled. For the US, unless you have a mitt full of war event cards and flower power is in effect, you are probably going to do more with those three operations points than you can with one victory point. Of course, if you are in a situation where you can win the game by the war games event, by auto victory, or even if you are looking to minimize the impact of the reformer event card, you can take the event. And sometimes in turn 10 when every victory point is useful and necessary, this could be headlined if you have nothing else better to do. So in summary, the Soviet player can generally play this card for the operations points, unless one of the specific special situations mentioned earlier are in play. For the US player, you will likely take the operations points unless that victory point helps you to win the game or if you desperately need to cancel the flower power event. This has been our analysis of the An Evil Empire card in the game Twilight Struggle. We hope you found this video useful and interesting, and if you did, please take a moment to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Thank you so much for watching. This is Legendary Tactics.